Okay, he just repeated himself. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to It's 8 Nitro. Babe Ruth takes on Johnny Lawrence, J-O-H-N-N-Y. Boba Fett will take on Dashing Dick Grayson for our good friend Dante. And Bison in a contendership match against Kate Skywalker. We'll see the quarterfinals of the women's tournament as Tia Gardner takes on Kimmy Schmidt and Chaz Michael Michaels on the Rum Burgundy exclusive. We're in Las Vegas now. Those were chilling words by, by Sinestro at the very beginning. There he is, the number one contender for the NCAA World Heavyweight Championship. Um, with him in the force, they, they took Guy Garner out of action, and Kate Skywalker is your number one contender for Superman Prime's NCAA World Heavyweight Championship. It's interesting, uh, a member of the Disney World Order will be taking on a member of the Evil Empire. These two do have history with each other. As some of you might remember in 2011, uh, M. Bison ended Kate Skywalker's first NCAA World Heavyweight Championship run. The fans are saying what they think about this man. To ignore the facts of history and the aggressive impulses of an evil empire. All right, tempo's about ready to change here. Oh, he brought company with him. This is a bit of a surprise here. MC World Heavyweight Champion. Superman Prime is going to be in observance of this match here. By the way, this is a non-title match. Prime is telling like it is. Them is fighting words. There's your NCAA World Title standings here. M. Bison is apparently the number two contender. I don't know how that works. I mean, he's successfully defended the uh, the hardcore title. Oh yeah, and he beat Peter Quill in a match once to take his spot. So. That's why M. Bison is so apparently high rated. One, two, and no. And are we, is, is he gonna skywalk this early in the match? 
And I think he paused. Cade Skywalker fall down, go boom. Bison ducked and uh Cade kind of choked himself on this on the top rope there. Superman Prime helping Cade up. You know, this is a big Pepsi Challenge question. Who are the fans going to side behind when these two finally face off for the NCAA world title? Oh! And Prime gets a big... Uh, piece of top rope action and a small package is he gonna pin him one two and no <coughs> Kate Skywalker is on fire not figuratively we don't have insurance for that we're still paying our Paul our, our, our co-pay on the, on the guy Gardner in the back and are we going to see Psycho Crusher on the top rope? This could be it. One, two, stick a... Kate kicks out. Code of Kate out of nowhere. And Prime sticks his nose in, in Kate's business. You know, a loss for Kate Skywalker at this point could be a setback, but he earned a title match. That is definitely coming his way down the road. And are we going to get Air Skywalker? Whoa! Jumping Jesus on a pogo stick! And Kate and Prime are having words. Now, Prime and Bison are having words. Hey, JBL, Cole, Lawler. Um, can you tell me what they said? Because you guys have my table, and that sucks. Oh, chair shot! I think Prime brought that chair in. I'll have to double check that footage, but kind of backfired on him a lot. DDT on that chair, and I'm surprised. Ah! Oh, I'm surprised the ref didn't disqualify him, but he's letting the match continue. Prime's distracting the rough. One, two. And it wouldn't matter, the ref wasn't even in place. The ref's doing the sensible thing by taking the chair out of the equation. Bison Karana. One, two. Ah, classic Ric Flair. Kate Skywalker puts his leg on the ropes. Devastating short arm DDT by Kate Skywalker. Bison's down. Whoa, love that agility. Stick a fork in him. Even Prime's giving Kate props. Prime is giving the number one contender props as we're in backwards universe here. And there's your winner and still number one contender for the NCAA World Champion, Kate Skywalker. Acting like a smug motherfucker. Go to San Francisco.
Francisco and the other smart people. You could drive Priuses. Stop. Enjoy your hybrid car. Whoa! Kryptonian clothesline! And S5. Bison making a little statement of his me, Superman Prime making a statement of his own. Saying, hey, it's not gonna be Cape Quack taking this NCAA world title. And there's your math for it winner, Superman Prime. Yeah, ref, don't give him the belt. He's just gonna do that. This was once the happiest place in the world. Disneyland. A magical place of adventure for children and their parents alike. But that was then. And this is now. I, I discover that happiness is a mask worn by those who dwell in misery. There is no such thing as true happiness. I had to commit this happiness. I can make you all just as miserable as you were meant to be. <laughs> Have you considered the possibility 